Prize AFL Grand Final. Two sides on the ground. The actual uh, Fish Creek seconds are doing the lap of honour after a, somewhat of a surprise result. The hot favourites, Devon Walsh going down by five points. Commiserations to Devon Walsh Bull side. Congratulations to the Fish Creek side on a, uh, a fine effort coming up, just getting in the finals and getting through and winning the grand final. Five points. Back to the uh, big game. We're before a capacity crowd here at the Aaron Oval, which is in absolutely magnificent condition. No breeze to speak of. Absolutely superb day for football. No excuses for either side. This game will be decided, I feel, on the on the physical physical uh, presence of the, the Devon Wellspool side. I think if they can use their body as they have been all year, they've had a bad year as far as ground conditions go out there at Devon. They've had a heavy ground all year and they've had to use their body strength a lot, which they've done well. Whereas Woodside, the ground's been good all year. They've played on some uh, dry grounds as the year's gone on towards the end of the year and they use their pace and their skill. But as I say, it's even up today with a dry ground. Might favour Woodside, but it's going to be a close finish. If I was asked to pick a winner, oh, gee, it's, it's a tough call. I reckon, well, it sounds like I'm trying to get out of it. We might be back here next week. Now, I'll switch over to the uh, commentator of the day. He's a, a man known around this area. Played a lot of footy for Yarron. Best and fairest of the Yarron Football Club. We'll take you over the old uh, Bear Mary. How are you, Bear? Yeah, all the best of both sides today. Great day for footy. If I was asked to pick a winner, I'd go for Devon. They're fresh. Yeah. Woodside won it last year, and I, I think that uh, Devon are going to be just that little bit hungrier on the day. They come out, they look pretty pumped up, but I wish, wish both sides best of luck. What do you reckon, Bear, about uh, the late uh, exclusions of Bragg from the Woodside team with a lot of pace and tenacious on the back line, and also Tullick as a late withdrawal as well? Is that going to affect their side, or do you think they can balance it out? I've got no doubt Woodside have picked their best side for the day. They know what they're doing. What do you think? Do you think they'll miss Bragg? Is it his pace on the back line? Maybe they could miss him, but, uh, you know, they've got the numbers and they back each other up. You know, there's no problem with that. Well, there's no that... problem about the sides. I think the best two sides have been picked. And um, it's just going to come down to who wants the ball hard enough. The one who goes the ball, I feel the one who goes the ball will win the game. Well, there's no doubt about that, and there's no, you can't doubt Devon's uh, approach to the ball. They've always been hard and tough. They've been well led by their coach, Andrew Pavey. He's been hard and tough with the ball all year. Have a look at young Andrew Pavey. He shaved his head for the day. Yeah, well, he has come along and shaved the old head. Fairly... Shaved his head, that's fair enough. Yeah, no, Trying he's... Trying to make a bit of an impression. No. You're right, mate? Yeah, back to uh, Devon and Andrew Pavey. He's led them well. They got him over from, from the church. He's a Churchill lad, been up to Tarsa and coach before. Uh, Devon had a, had a quite a hard decision at the start of the year. They caught a number of applications, and um, the old co-commentator himself, Ben Mary, was one of them. But uh, they chose Andrew Pavey, and uh, he's done the job, and they're there on the last day of the year, which is the most important day. Good no luck doubt. to them. No doubt they've picked wisely with their coach. <laughs> <laughs> Special yeah. comments from the old bear. <laughs> yeah, no, he's done well getting them, getting them there, but like they've amalgamated this year and obviously it's strengthened the club. They've had the seconds in and like, you know, we wish both sides the best of luck for the day. Thanks, Bear. Well, it, hopefully it'll be a good game. All we want is a tight grand final and let the ball be bounced. The boys are just lining up. Let's all be up stood. Sure, that little whiskey. Last year, yeah, the mic. Alright. Okay, we're here for ready for the uh, first bounce of the big game, the 1995 AFL Grand Final. Between Have a look at them on the outer wing. Devon Walshpool and Woodside. Boys are jostling around on the outer wing. The toss is one of the lead by Andrew Pavey, the coach of Devon Walshpool's side. And he is elected to uh, kick to the church road end. First bounce of the ball in the AFL Grand Final, 1995. 
Berger up against Roy. Berger, first kick of the 85 grand final. Kicks out wide to the flank. 95. Rogers. 95 wins. Oh, 85. Well behind. <laughs> Jack, Jack Barty, well kicked. Handballs to his brother, Spears. Spears up, makes it up onto the feet. Handball Good hands. Peter Good Lynch, hands. Veteran of the side. Too high. Free kick to Peter Lynch. He'll come back and yeah, take Yeah, didn't have it. Experienced campaigner, Peter Lynch. Been here and done it before. And can do it again. Played a lot of games on this ground, of course, Peter, hasn't he? Short yeah. passes over to Jennings. Jennings plays on. Looks to lead further up the ground. Ben Ryan. Ben Ryan drops a march. Play on calls the umpire. Garner kicks off the ground. Kicks it out wide. Kerr, who's a top little player in the juniors, played a few games for the power this year. Plays on Garner off the ground again. Kelly scrambled early on in this game here in the grand final, which is to be expected. He's I picking guess. that out of nothing. No kick there, but the umpire's played it. Good comments, Bear, on the umpires. You've liked them all the career. Play on, says the umpire. Jack Brody again punches. Oh, well played. Handball's out. Handball's the fumble. Here's a chance. Dixon off the ground. McDonald clears yeah. for Devon Wells full shot. Cool in defence. Yeah. Pushes out of bounds. Umpire calls, throw it in. The crowd looks for a free kick. Wasn't there. No surprising start to the game. Everyone in their peak positions. No one really picking up Littler. Who is it? Speak of the devil. Gets the ball over to Lynch. Kicks off. Daniel Hanley coming out from centre half back. Ex Yarren boy, Daniel Hanley. Ex Yarren boy, Daniel Hanley. Making a good career for himself at Woodside. The umpire balls Played it up. Played a good game in the uh, first semi bear down at Tarwin. One of the best players. Actually, the uh, foster player picked him as the auction player of the Woodside team that day. Bounce down. Burger once again. As you all are in, out of the centre. Good play. Pass it over to Phil. I'd say it's the first goal of the game. No offline. One point to Duncan Philby from the Devon Walsh School side. First score of the 95 AFL Grand Final. Plenty of time. Didn't realise how much time he had. Should have stayed and kicked the goal. He's a loose man. Kick short. Yeah, they're playing well. Lawson. Kicks wide to Chisholm. Peter Lynch had a few touches early. But always clever. A lot of experience there. 40 years of age, by far the oldest man on the ground. Still fakes for free kicks for no experience. reason. <laughs> Fierce Summers. Summers. Play yeah. on calls down for yeah, That's a good decision. Had no chance. Ball up. Come on, Pavey! Free kick oh, is stupid. Probably wasn't that good of a decision by the coach there to react like that when it was going to be a ball up. One hand. On. Yeah, he must have thrown that. Free kick, free kick to Young Hall. Young Hall from one on Woodside. Son of uh, Brian and Heather Hall, the old dairy men in Yarra. 40 metres out. The distance shouldn't be a problem. I'll just pass over you, Bear. What do you think of this young boy, the old uh, ex Yarram junior, going out to one on Woodside? No, he's pretty steady over the kick. Should kick this from here. Yeah. And has. Beautiful kick. Woodside put the first goal on the board. First goal, as Bear said, the first goal along on Woodside. Pavey walks back to the centre, his head dropped. No doubt he's there to fight another day. Plenty of talk from the crowd. You can hear the crowd in the back, oh, cheers. You can hear the crowd in the back line. They could rue that. Well, it wasn't that good a free kick to give away at that stage, but it's only early. Nerves will settle down. Beautiful bounce by the umpire. Tap to Devon. Burger mops up. Bit eye. He'll get up, don't worry about him. Been playing for a lot of years. Ex AFL best in Paris. Handball's off. Lawson, second kick for the day. Could be a good inclusion, Lawson. Yeah, in the back. The umpires are right on the ball there. Three kicks are definitely going one on Woodside's way. I can't say that they're playing the ball more than Devon. Yeah, no, nah, they're deserved. Just given everything that's here. That's in the back. In the back. Yeah. Now, these umpires know what they're doing. Well, what do you think, Bear, about the three umpire situation today? Like, is one on the boundary? They'll be, he can, he's got the rule to, uh, got the authority to order off and report. Well, well it's it. obviously made for a lot cleaner grand final. In past years, we've seen a lot of fighting. Pavey by himself. Doesn't play on, goes back for his yeah. kick. Kicks long. Up they go. Drops a mark. It's a bit ugly. 
plenty of time though, Devon. Beautiful pass. Jason Roo's got the market sent out for yeah. After chest mark from Ben Ryan. He's a big man, he's a good target. Goes back, taking his time. One of the last four boys that have joined the combination. That's a shocking kick. Have a look at that. Steve Sainall. Straight to Steve Sainall. Long kick out of defence. Bergevitt taps over the top. Long kick again, yeah, good play. Mongo McDonald and Pavey. Eddie Lithgow on the left foot. Yeah, Jack Barty goes in hard, real hard. Taps it out. Quick hands by Devon. Lithgow kicks over the head. There a chance here in deep in the forward pocket, but no, out of bounds. Up by score, out of bounds, deep in the forward pocket, Devin Walsh ball in. It's one of the main dangers for Warren and Woods, I think, there will be uh, Ben Ryan on a forward flank. Absolutely elusive player. Tremendous skills, they can feed it out to him and he can feed off the packs. Haven't seen him play for a while. He was a fine player in his junior career, but yeah. played oh, for Fish play. Creek. Good play. Come back halfway through the year for Devin Walsh for yeah. side. No chance to get rid of it. Got and the umpire balls it up. Coming, I don't know if he's coming back from injury or he got dropped, but he come back one of the games, get 12 goals, I think about 12 8 in the, in the reserves. Was, I don't care what grade you're playing, he kicked that many shots. The senior goals. grand final is a lot different to reserve football lands. I understand that, I understand that. I'm just trying to tell you some of the stats. Pavey clears out on the wing for Devin. Good handball over to Underwood. Another ex Sharon player. But Good reliable. Play. Long kick. Punch out by St. Off. Let's go. In the middle of the pack. Didn't Good have kick. it. Bit thicky touchwood. But a fine young kick, this young man. Should kick this from here. Let's go. Started on the back line for Devon. Has moved his way up. Devon Walsh ball. These are the type of goals Devon need to kick if they're going to win the game. Can't afford to miss from straight in front, about 35 metres out. Runs in. Lovely kick. Made no mistake. Straight through. Hear the crowd. They're obviously for Devon. Devon Walsh pool. Well, it hasn't been the opening I thought it would be. I thought it'd be a bit of a hard tussle early. Everyone's playing in. the ball. There's nothing wrong with yeah. that. Another playing the ball. Bergwood up against Reed. Reed wins a tap out. Littler, good hands as usual. Peter Lynch, another kick. Once again, he goes down for no reason, but gets it up there. Good Dunkley mark by Dunkley. Off. Jennings. Evelson clears from Deep in the forward out. line. Pretty scrambly foot here. Definitely got a chance. Yeah, well played. Yeah, the hands are good. Definitely got a loose man here. And Flanagan passes straight to Vardy. Going to kick long. No mark. Philby kicks it through for one behind. Shouldn't have missed from there. Had more time than he realised. Pressure for grand final. Have a look for the Blues with the loose man at the kick out. They're perfecting this. Taking his time. Pavey goes up. Don't know if that was there, but anyway, kick the, kick the wood side. Beautiful play, well smothered. Pavey butters up. Well played. Jack Vardy gets a handball. Straight to Chisholm. That's terrible play. Devon's defence runs it out of bounds. We'll just, we'll just go and tug his hands one for one. 
At a bounce on the half forward flank, probably close with the pocket for the one on Woodside team. Bound up by throws it in. Summers will be up against Vardy here in this contest. Summers in the front position. Punts behind from Rufko. Jones in the front, taps it on, out of bounds, sound by calls again. Back for another boundary uh, throwing by the umpire. Summers and Vardy again contest to contest. Summers in front again. Vardy gets the punch out from behind. Walpole uses his body. Garner comes through with a good shepherd. Ball comes over the top. Beautiful shepherd. Good art football. Underwood picked up by Underwood in the back pocket. Plays on. Has a bounce. Goes the boundary line. Very risky. Looks for Olorenshaw out wide there. Good contest there. Olorenshaw comes out well. Kicks out on his left. Pavey comes through from the wing. Taps the ball and kicked off, kicked off the ground by Howie. Out to the wing area. Ben Ryan wedging the race to the ball. It's another throw in. Once again, out of bounds on the outer side of the ground. Good tight, art fo good tight hard football. What you'd expect in the first quarter, Lance? Well, there's no great, there's no great uh, spectacle at this stage, but that's what we expect in the first quarter. Sorting each other out. Dixon off the ground, gets it to a half forward spot. Jones comes through. Jack Bart, he's a magnificent player. Playing for a free kick. He's a great player. Handballs off, handball's off to Jennings. Kicks long. Beautiful to kick. The Aaron ground. Kick long. Punched away by Evelston. Over towards that man again, Ben Ryan. If you can pick a man out, he'd do the job. Goes in the forward pocket. Steve St. All. Grabs a ball yeah. and runs it out of bounds. Runs it out of bounds. It's good defence. Well, he's been around a long time, St. All there. He's uh, played a lot of footy. Before he came to the Wander on Woodside team, he played in five successful grand final teams. So that's a lot of experience to bring to a club. Yeah. There's a lot of experience. Good luck to him. And we'll wait to Philby. Umpires play dropping the ball. Good stiff, fell over. Had the ball though. Didn't get rid of it. Good decision. You sure about that, B? Pretty, yeah, I'm pretty <laughs> happy about that. <laughs> well, over the top. Through from Summers. Play oh, Rog. Another. Summers, good play down at uh, Tail in, in the first semi. Judge is probably best to field. A little bit quieter last week, but expecting big things from Been him. Been overseas today. this year, Roger, but. Fine, finely tuned athlete and ready to give his best today. Scramble out there on the outer side. Yeah, good hands. Dropped it. Yeah, good decision. Another late comer, Dwayne Nicholas, in dispute with the club at the start of the year. It's worked things out. It's come back. A little bit overweight, but he's been a good player up to this game. Umpire paying the free kick. There was probably advantage there, but he, in his in his mind. Bring it back. Back to Jack Vardy. Taking his time, trying to pick someone out. Beautiful kick. Good lawyer from Stick Dunkley from centre forwards. First mark for the game, second kick. Focal point though. Absolutely, it's vital to the Devon Walsh. We saw that he gets involved at centre forward. Short pass to Fred Lynch, taking the mark on the flank. Fred Lynch could kick it from here. Well, Seen him kick many goals from here. Well, he's had a few shots now over the years. He'll definitely have it. Let me tell you one thing. He will not pass it. <laughs> he will not pass it. That is harsh. You can take that to the bank. Has a shot. Unfortunately, sure. doesn't make the distance. Berwin in front. Ben Ryan again. He's a, he's a real threat, Ben Ryan. Yeah, Devon Ford line working hard to keep the ball in attack. Crowd's very quiet. Not much action going on. Sorting each other out here. Dunkley gets the hands off. Snap. Beautiful kick. Byron Smith. Snap by Byron Smith. Byron Smith, Smith yep. Court. Good hands by Dunkley. Set that up though. Quick Snap. hands. Scores two goals to one, favourite Devon. Two two to one goal. Get out of the way, runner. Jocks Underwood again, playing well. 
Bad kick though, kicked it straight on the tit of Lidler. Sees a lead from Nicholas, plenty of time. Oh, kicks it into the man on the mark, Olorenshaw. Gets the hands off. Paul handballs it straight to Lithgow. Gee, Woodside are under pressure. Jocks under it again, kicks long out of defence. Straight to no one though. Hanley is clear, plenty of time. Beautiful kick. There's a pass a little, he ignores the pass. Beautiful kick. Jones. Yeah, new play this year, coming in the bank in the air. Woodside picking him up away. Taking his time, he's about 52 out, thinks That's he can kick it. Absolutely. He's got no hope. He's running around him, trying to do a paddy gribble. Oh, he's. That's a terrible kick. Berg of it. Pavey against three. Have a look at him battling away. Yeah, beautiful interception. He's had about seven possessions, Peter Lynch. I tell you what, he knows all about this type of football. Dunkley gets in front and takes the mark. Good hands. Handball's off. Olorenshaw, plenty of time, kicks long. It's all Woodside, have a look at him in defence. Could have had a cut lunch there. Plenty of time. Have a look at him. That's a terrible kick. Straight to Byron Smith. Could be a costly turnover, Barry. Straight to Spear Vardy. Passes the ball. That was a throw, but the umpire didn't see it. Good play by Chisholm. Good Chisholm play. kicks long. Yeah, good mark. Beautiful mark by Jansen. Goes back for his kick. Yeah, Mongo punches. Quick hands, Anderson, Paul. Fumbles, fumbles under pressure. Have a look at this Devon defence. They're working overtime. Anderson. Anderson. Gets the ball from nowhere and slaps a brilliant left foot goal. What a goal. What a goal. Oh, that's been a feature of his game and all year. And have a look at that chest pump up. Has that been a feature of his game all year, Bear? He's kicked over 100 goals two years in a row. He's been a great player. He's got his, uh, he's got his knockers out there, but he's, he can't knock over 100 goals two years in a row. No doubt the man can play. No, he can play football. Only needs right. a couple of chances. Yeah. That's exactly what Woodson Devin want to think very seriously about him. He is the focal point for Woodside. If he goes, goes Woodside goes. Kevin Walsh will sort of made a change. Pavey gets it out of the centre. He's been replaced by, uh, by Pearson. Daniel Hanley out in front of Stick. Dunkley kicks on his left. Straight to Pavey though. Pavey takes a timely mark. Handballs to Jocks Underwood. He kicks up and up and under. Plenty there, but Woodside. Come through, falls over, trips Lawson. over his own feet, Lawson. Lost his feet. Yeah, Daniel Hanley. Playing well. Playing well. Stick Dunkley doesn't like this. Gonna have to curb him. Oh, that's stupid. Pulled over the neck. A magnificent mark up against two Devon Walsh pool players and then reefed around the neck for no reason. 50 metre penalty against Devon Walsh pool side. Jocks Underwood, a bit unusual. Plays it tough, he doesn't need to give away free kicks like that. The ball is in the reliable hands of the old coach, Brendan Whitler. He'll kick from 30 metres. Not the best style, but very reliable kick. I'd say he missed this. First quarter of a grand final. So you put the stamp right on him, Bear. I think he'll miss it. I'll back him in to kick it. Runs in. Lines up. Head over the ball. Off to the right. Yes, Bear, you're right. He misses. <laughs> Tex Highland in for special comments. Good to see you, Tex. Ex Devon player. What do you think of the game so far? I really believe that um, Devon seemed to be a bit, bit harder on the ball. Bit hurried at the ball, you think? A bit harder at the ball. A bit harder. Yes. It's early days and I think the nerves are still settling down. I think everyone's by, obviously very nervous. By the second half of the second quarter, it's all the tail, but I think the third quarter today is critical. Have a look at Devon's defence. Jennings kicks long from defence. 
But straight to no one again. Daniel That's Hanley, he's on fire. Vital contest between Hanley and on Hanley fire. Jansen. Taking his time. Should be playing on. This is 90s football. Good long kick. Plenty of numbers for Devon, though. Summers leaps. Good hands by Jack Vardy. Little chip pass. Get up. Keeps his feet and passes beautifully. You must stay on your feet. Paul takes the mark, kicks long. Deep into the goal square. Comes off the Rush pack. Devon rushes it through. It's good play by their defence. They're playing well. They are playing well, aren't they, Lance? It's good to have Tex Holland here with us. Tex played a lot of footy for Devon Walsh. Well, obviously, we know where your allegiance lie today. And uh, he confident the boys will play for win this year. Jack Vardy kicking to Pavey. Well, I'm pretty confident that the boys will have a win. Uh, I feel a bit sorry for a very good friend of mine, Dean Vardy, who misses out today through suspension. I played in the 83 grand final, and um, Bob Crawford went through the same situation. Bob got suspended in the preliminary, missed out in the grand final. Yeah, well, they have copped a few over the years, the Devon boys. Obviously, though, football, you must go the ball. The rules are there in place, and that's how you've got to play. Pavey goes in hard. Have a look at... Here they go, Nicholas. Elusive around goals. And slams it straight through. And gives a high five. What do you think? He's a friggin' West Indian. <laughs> good goal boy, Nicholas, running down from the wing. No, nah, it's good play. Good play. Thanks, mate. Cheers. We'll catch up with you. Well, Brian said to bring three over, mate. I don't know. Umpire. Bounces the ball. Another beautiful bounce. Once again, Devon win the tap out. Good sort of made the chains there. Bear Walpole's come off after that heavy collision Kerr with Pavey and uh, Warren McKenzie, who wasn't actually in the original selected side, but he come in after late withdrawal from Bragg, takes the field. Yeah, it's pretty unlucky. Grand finals, people late withdrawing through injury. Bragg has been a great player for Warren Woodside this year. He's caught up with the flu and he just couldn't shake it off. One on Woodside thought it was best to leave him out. I'll have a look at Littler. It's good good vision, Littler. good vision, just didn't quite top it off with good hands. But this Devon defence, pretty desperate. Umpires pluck one Umpires out. Umpires pick one out. He's picked one out for no reason. As a matter of fact, that wasn't that good a decision. <laughs> if you don't mind, umpire. Anyway, he's here to do a job and so are we. We might as well just enjoy ourselves and on with the show. <laughs> Stick Dunkley out in front. Fly on the top. Working hard. No, it's good play. Fumbles. Peter Lynch. Got a bit of time. Kicks long. Eddie Lithgow. Yeah, out muscled. Steve Sainor. Steve Sainor. Great mark in the back line, as I said to Bear before. Brings a lot of experience. Passes off to Chip. Played well in the deep last line of defence. Played real well this quarter. Falling forward, going for a free kick when it's not there. Pavey works hard out of a pack. Kicks long. That man again, Ryan, you just find his touch. Out of bounds. Out of bounds to the forward pocket of the Devon Walsh full side. Devon, Devon are needing a goal. Scores 3 2 20 to 2 2 14. Only a goal in it. Very close at this stage. Just feeling each other. Feeling the way. Breaks. That's the worst decision I've ever seen. You've got to at least have a chance. Kicks long on the left. About five blokes go up. Littler on the bottom of the pack gets the hands off. Beautiful play. Have a look at this Devon defence. Work it out of bounds. Oh, stupid. And the umpire throws it in. Jock Sandwood just making his presence felt over there against Dwayne Nicholas. No love lost between those two boys. Ex teammates at Yarram, Jock Sunderwood and Dwayne Nicholas. Good mates they used to be, but now they're on opposing sides. Anyway, who cares about the ex Yarram players? <laughs> <laughs> they're playing for 
<laughs> Devon Walsh for the side one. We're not interested in that shit. <laughs> and up they go. Whoops. Phone call. Update from Melbourne. Oh, beautiful mark. Last line of defence. Hello. By Reedy. Yeah, first Jay Jason uh, Reed. Kicks to Vardy. 3 2, good side, 2 4, Gavin. Yeah, good hands. Oh, no, it's. Philby. It's tough, really. Oh, Pave has been like a couple of. Got rid of him after he kicked up the umpire, doesn't oh, play it. Two defences are both holding Let's go, up. with well, pace. On the left. Of play each, but scrubs it along the ground. Well, scrubs along the ground. Well. Oh, yeah. Woodside desperate. No. Beautiful no, play. Ball up in Yeah. Absolutely. 3 2 to 2 2. Umpire bounces. Bergman right. gets a tap. I'll, I'll oh, what a magnificent that. tap. Right on. Kicks long. McKenzie slips over. Pavey cleans up. I'll oh, have a look at this. Runs oh, in and slams it through. What a goal. What a goal oh, Pavey. this man can play. That's and the scores are level 3 2 20 to 3 2 20. Did that hairstyles help his face a bit there, Rowan? <laughs> well, he has shaved his head today. And who cares? Because he looks pretty mean. That's a grand final, and that's all that counts. You can do whatever you want in grand finals. That was definitely a captain's goal. Inspiration for Devon football. Umpire walks in. Umpire, huge ass. Bounces the ball. Yeah, he's paid a throw. Very harsh. Littler over the top of the ball. Big call. Call on Littler for the throw. He's probably one of the best handballers in the comp. But Howie didn't even know he had it, but he'll accept it. Could have been under pressure. Goes back. Going to keep long centre half forward. Oh, have a look at that. Eppleston. Eppleston. Kicks, kicks a big up and under. Out to the outer wing. Devon are quick with their hands. Little chip pass. Loose man. The umpire's paying anything at the moment. Umpire? Jennings there. Jennings in the gloves. Got to bring it back. Blown time on, must bring it back. Spear right out of the shot. Spear has a shot, kicks a goal. But there's uh, no reason for that as he's blown time on, you must bring the ball back. Two minutes to go here in the first term. Should have been timing. <laughs> Two minutes to go. Scores are level. And can't you feel the tension? Everyone's silent. The whole crowd is silent. There's just a buzz. Everyone's in just sheer anticipation of such a big game. Handballs to Pavey, kicks long. Have a look at that for a leap. It's a Ben Ryan again. Working hard, yeah, he didn't have it. Fire. He's I, the ball. I think you are uh, speaking from the Devon point of view, and they like I think they might be having it on. No, they're not. Stick runs in, but as soon as they see him, off they go. But if a player's got control of the ball, he didn't have control. He should be doing in possession. He did not have control. Didn't have control. It's a good decision. These umpires are doing a good job. Last line of defence. Daniel Hanley playing a great game against Stick. Kicks long. Is a vital contest there. Oh, they're Kicks leaping from everywhere and no one marks. Chisholm again, runs it Chisholm. out. Chisholm, desperate, desperate. Been a tough first quarter. Berg of it again, in the ruck, tries to grab it out. One of his ploys, Berger, he's a big, strong man up against a young, a young fella. Tries to use his body, grab the ball, handball it off. A lot of experience. I'd say though he's losing in the ruck, ruck tap outs today so far. Yeah, good mopping up to Dunkley. Paid in the back. Goes for the mark. Umpire's paid in the back. He could kick it from here. Very experienced footballer. Puts a hand up. Passes. Up to Pavey. 
over the shoulder. Another. Play that against. Well, I didn't see that. They've given that to Pavey. Obviously, shepherding out while he was going for the ball. This is a vital kick. Cannot be much longer before quarter time. Well, I couldn't quite see that one was full of air, but they paid it anyway. And so there isn't much longer before quarter time. Whatever he kicks, he'll put him in front by that at the first change. Jogs in. Straight Long kick. Slams it through. Oh, this bloke can play. This bloke can play. Tex, go down and see what he says a quarter time and come back and tell us. Give you a report on Devon or... Yeah. Tex Highland, off to the coaching, off to the seat, listen to the coaches. Going to do the boundary, boundary yeah. rider at quarter time. Man on the boundary. Good to see you. Okay. Okay, uh, Bear, we're back in the uh, start of the second quarter. Big game at the Yarran Ground. 1995 AFL Grand Final. Quarter time scores is uh, four goals, two to the Devon Wellsville combination to three goals, two to the one on Woodside team. Very here's, even first quarter. Here's the boundary rider, Tex Holland. What do you have, Tex? Back from the uh, What do you have back sides? from the coaches, mate? Okay. Woodside is saying that he's praising his back line, saying they're doing a job, but everyone needs to lift. They're playing about 70%. They all need to lift. Look what, Devon side, Devon saying that their forward line needs to work a lot harder. He also wants the whole side lift. They're both saying about the same sort of thing. They're both are playing about 70, 80%. Well, we'd have to agree with that. It is a game of defences at the moment, isn't it? It is. It's going back to it the is. rebound yeah. football. Devon have decided that this is the quarter they're going to take it up to them. They're going to play hard at the ball. So he if, wants the forward line to run a lot more. He wants everyone to lift their rate. If someone in the forward line can stand up and be counted, they can win the game for him. There's a lot of nerves out there. There is a lot of nerves. Anyway. Both coaches, there's a lot of pressure on Thanks, Tex, for that comment. If about three or four goals, you're right. Okay, first bounce up goes. Olorenzo gets a break out on the forward flank. Handball's back deep to Underwood on the... He's under pressure. Gets around Olorenzo. He's a good player, Underwood, under pressure. He was the best player last final by a mile. Garner in front. Good strong mark to Garner. Reynolds from behind. That's class. Good player, Garner. He's had a great year. He's only 22 or 23. For a big future. He's reported to be going with Tower Valley next year. Kicks long to the flank. Howie, good mark to Howie on the half back flank. As Tech said, our boundary rider said it's a battle of the uh, back lines, and that's the way it's been going, hasn't it, Bear? Well, have a look at these defences. It's just one on one. It's going from centre half back to centre half back. Anyone in the forward line who can, who can stand up and take a mark is going to tear this game right open. Bergwitz passed it. Straight to. Thompson that kicks off the half-back flank. McDonald goes up for the mark. Drops the mark and is hit out of bounds. Out of bounds, deep in the forward pot for the one on Woodside team. Umpire comes back into play, ready to throw the ball in. The breeze is getting up a bit here, favouring the church or in which this quarter the uh, one on Woodside team is kicking to. I'd say they would need to take full advantage of this quarter and uh, have a handy lead at half time. Break out of the pack, Jones on his natural left footer has a snapshot. I'd say he's kicked truly bare, is that a good shot? That's a yeah, but did you see the tap out from Summers? Great tap out from Summers. Hit it straight to Jones, well snapped it on there. his left foot and brings the score. Scores level, 4-2 apiece. Well, as Ian Robinson would say on the old uh, Channel 7, it's a start of one on Woodside we're after. But you're not Ian Robinson and I'm not <laughs> Bruce McAvaney, so let's not kill each other. <laughs> <laughs> so it was a start thereafter. Yeah. No, that was a start thereafter. And I'll tell you what, this wind has sprung up. It could be a two goal win, two or three goals in the first term. There was no wind. As I say, it's getting up a bit. We kept it on that Jones boy. He's uh, perfect opportunists and he's done a job over the finals games for him and he's taking on again this year. Up they go in the ruck. Bergevitt wins it. Desperate out in the wing. Then we get the kick in. Bluey Flanagan Flan gets the kick. Spear. He's got plenty of time, but runs it out of bounds. Had a quiet game, really, Spear. Yeah, he hasn't been that prominent yet. He's one of the main players. He didn't fire up. And uh, him, when he comes in, his brother usually goes jack, and they're an absolute power for the Devon side. This... Tuss off the boot. And it's a good side. decision. Good decision. 
Both sides are very desperate. You can hear the wonder what's all running down below, well done, Lords. And here's one in surprise packet. I just wonder whether they can hang on and uh, he might run a bit short of breath. He's I'll tell you another player. bloke who's played well, Sainal. Oh, great player. As I said, I can't praise him enough. He's brought a lot of experience to the club. Oh, Tony, Tony. Kerr grabbed it out of the ruck, slammed on his left foot and out in the full. Pavey goes up for it. Uh, it's good roving there though by Lawson. Kerr gets it again. Nicholas. Oh, he's hanging back a bit. Barty's going in hard. Lawson. Uh, someone's grabbed him around the neck. Was a bit high. Uh, the umpires are giving them when they're there. Can't knock them. One good thing about this game, everyone's going the football, no one's going the man. It's good to see. I think this new rule about being kicked off the ground. Well, it's played a big part of the football now. But he's got all the time in the world. It's a terrible handball though. Puts himself and his teammate under pressure. Kicks well. Cordial punches from behind. Chisholm grabs it. Well, they're having a bit of a blue ear, but they're only pushing. There's nothing in it. Nothing will happen. They can't afford to get kicked off. Here comes Pavey. Dixon gets it. Have a look at this. Oh, that's good, tough footy. Oh, Spear Barty. He's got plenty of time. Kicks, a, kicks out in front. Randall. Randall's got it and dropped it. Had all the time in the world. Oh, and he's turned it around. That's a joke. That's a joke. He's trying to turn it into basketball. That's not there. It's a beautiful tackle. Beautiful tackle, and he's just given it. That's, Lance, that's got to be one of the worst decisions in front well, of goal you've seen. Flash. It's typically on Pine and Oil leagues this year, and down in the big league as well. They're trying to he's, he's hit it spot on. He's turning into basketball. He's kicked long. Stick Dunkley goes up for it. Oh, that's good play by Eppleston. Have a look at this bloke. Who's on him? He's tearing the shreds. Well, this, is a, this is what we thought Spear Barney could do. He could come on into the game. But He's tearing the shreds this quarter. Jennings falls over. There's no kick there. Oh, dear, oh, dear. How can you give that umpire? I think there's a few soft ones starting to come into it. The umpire's overreacting. They maybe think this game could get out of control, but absolutely overreacting at this stage. Dixon has come into it this term, though. There's another one. I think it wasn't quite there, but anyway. I think you've got to be allowed to fly for the football. No. Littler's got the ball. Taking his time, trying to pick someone out on the halfback flank. Doesn't usually waste it. Scoreboard side of the ground. Oh, and he has picked someone out. Summers, but he dropped the mark. Oh, he got to hold your feet in that situation. Yeah, Jack Barty gets the hands off to Pavey. Handballs to himself, backs himself. Run the ball off in front of him out in the outer wing. Have a look at him with the ball dead. He's going all right, though. Oh, beautiful hands to Underwood. Kicks long. Once again, once again, Hanley. He's been hit hard. Will he get up? It's not moving much there. <coughs> He'll get up. He'll get up. He's all right. It's a grand final. He's playing a fantastic game, this Blake Lance. Well, as I said, it's a big factor between him and Stick Nutley. Sent half back and sent half forward, respectively. Switches the play. Lawson again. He's in trouble. Takes him on. Anderson, 100 goals. No, Summers. Summers. Sorry, mistake there. Listen to the crowd, he's popular. Anderson. Anderson. Oh, great marble. That his work on it there. It was a full forward. Good marking. Come from nowhere. Come Takes from nowhere point. to take that. Three behind in the pack. I must admit, there, who's been a surprise packer to me, has lost in the back pocket. I didn't think he'd come up. I thought he'd... Thanks, Tex, for the refreshments. I didn't think Lawson come up because he missed too many games. This is a big kick, this one.
scores a level of 4 2 each. Vital kick. Oh. And may I say, never looked like missing. We've had this game so far. He's played okay. He's making his way to the band today. Eh? Corey Jansen, they might be looking for a bit of uh, strength on the Could floor. be the long sleeves. Bit hot, needs a bit of a spell. <laughs> no, he's done all right. It's good to see these young blokes in the changing off the bench. Have a look at the kids on the other side of the boundary. That's wrong. They should be over the fence land. Especially in the grand final. It'd be nothing yeah, worse well, than seeing one of the players run through a little kid. Yeah, it could be tragic for, for the crowd there. Yeah. Back onto the football. Hit out by Summers again. Picked up by, by Budgie. Down, umpire play down. No, it's out of bounds. Call back, throw in. Forward flank. In front of the uh, Fish Creek banner on the uh, half forward flank the one on Woodside team. Fish hardly Creek call it a banner. Successful in the second field was a bit of a surprise. Yeah, I the think club. they may have been also successful in the thirds. Obviously yeah, got right. a lot of yeah, depth in the club. That's right, and the seniors really knocked out last week. Yeah. Back on to the big one. Fish Creek have had a lot of success over the year, over the years, and it's good to see them not here today. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been a favourite of mine, Fish Creek. <laughs> Similar to Minion. Uh, knocked out last week by this one on Woodside team. Play on the ball, smothered. Kicks it into his back. Wasn't smothered. Byron Smith, the assistant coach of the uh, Devon side. Big five. Spear Vardy. Spear Vardy. Slips off the gloves. It's Jennings in there, looking for the free no play on Walpole underneath. You the must ball it up. Yeah, it's a good decision. Ball up. It's a ball up, says the interjecting bear. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I've never seen a crowd this big at Yarram Lance. No, I, I think it might be a record crowd. Probably something to do with having local teams in it for a change. Well, yeah, well, there's been a lot of interest this week in this game, one on Woodside and Devon. A lot of talk on how the game would have panned out. And who They're fierce would... rivals, fierce rivals. Absolutely. The old, as they call it, the old local derby. That's it. Pavey gets it again, slams it on the boot. And kicks on the floor. Goes out of bounds, bit stiff. Bit stiff. As I say, Bear, that wind's got up, it's a ball of quarter. One on Woodside, in my view, we need to kick it. Summer's up. going up, Two man in front. Goals. Plenty of Devon numbers in. Must pick it up. Lynch. Peter Lynch once again, gives it the up and under. Pavey. Getting a lot of the football, a lot of the football. Handballs it out in front of all the He drops it. Back to Pavey. Oh, have a look at this. Oh, have a look at that. What a stupid thing to do. That's got to be 50 by Sainor. There's no need for that. Well, he, I suppose... No he, need for that. I suppose you've heard of, you've heard of him making you it. He's 23. Is that Philby grabs it and kicks a goal. That makes the score 5 2 32 Devon Welshpool to 5 2 32 Woodside Wanderon. And can't you feel the tension, Lance? It is building up. Do you think Wanderon Woodside there they might feel a bit of pressure? They know that breeze has got, they've got to make the most of this quarter. You could be right. In grand finals, you don't even think about bruises. Well, as I say, it's very moderate, not much to talk of, but psychologically. Bergevit. Between the end of school. Bergevit and Barty again. Barty gets that one down. Straight to Litley, who grabs it and drops it, and the umpire doesn't pay nothing. Yeah, he's got a lift too. He hasn't been that. Garnick. Hasn't been that prominent for the combined side, as in one on which side. That was in the back. Pavey again. Working the ball forward. Oh, it's tough in the packs here. Garner gets it again. It high. The umpire pays it high. Don't do anything silly. Have a look at this. Switch the play where the numbers are. Switches the play to the half forward, half forward flank. Oh, that is painting. That's a terrible decision. Pass it to Anderson. That's good defence. Anderson's got it though. Slams it on the foot. She's an up and under. On the full. Out in the full. 
Do you think he was looking for anyone? I think he was looking for the goals. Well, that's his job. That is his job, kicking goals. But that far out, he probably, probably could look for a short pass. Harry Wasn't much in. on. Wasn't much on. Harry kicks in from the back pocket for the Devon Walsh side. Stuart Bartley, hasn't there been that problem at this stage? He needs to probably lift a bit for the Devon Walsh He's been side. terrible around the ground, but in the in the bounce-ups, he's doing OK. Yeah, probably he's doing all right in the rocks, but Billy would probably been the winner around the ground. I think in the ruck, they're nullifying each other, like they're doing a bit of body on body. Henry's a bit stronger, but Vardy's got the leap. Once again, they take each other out of it. Ball yeah. running out to the outer wing. Good oh. pass, Jennings. Pass it on to This Jennings has got a bit of class, Lance. Yeah, good play. He's run a good play from kicking goals from forward pocket goal kicking. Pavey. Finds a coach on the forward flank. He has to be stopped, because he's playing very well. Looking for Stick Dunkley. Stick Dunkley struggling a bit under injury, I'd say. He's limping a bit, oh. so his knee's a bit crook. That's a terrible kick. Oh, big oh, elbow and misses. Could have took him oh. out for anything it's worth. Jason Rudy, the high one. I would have hated to have seen that. Bit crude on Rudy, the old mate from Wellsville. Bit crude in the middle of the pack. Anyway. He's a good player, this young kid, Kerr. Yeah, top kid, top junior. Reminds me, as he, reminds me of his father. Oh, yeah, Got the 24 on, left foot. A lot of class about him. Johnny Curry is a top player there. Kicks long. They all go up. Budgie Jansen had a wild snap from the forward pocket and kicks out a four on the opposite side of the ground. Free kick to be taken by the Devon Walsh full side. I'll tell you what, the crowd's intrigued with this game, aren't they? Well, it's up for grabs. They're not roaring, everyone's just nervous. Last line of defence for Devon. Long kick. Woodside have got the numbers. Go another up. Play, another play, moves the left, he's going to be quiet. Umpire's played drop on the ball. Kicks long, Bergevin in front. Takes a mark and never looked like dropping it. Played from behind, probably should have punched. Should be handballing off to the quick blokes. Well, I know you get the running game going. They tell me that the difference... It's a bit stagnant. The difference in the game is going to be Woodside's running game. They need to run off. That's at Jones again, the opportunity. High kick in the air. Anyone's ball under it, under it. Heads for the boundary. Did well. Runs the way he worked the ball into the last line, out, of, out of bounds, you know, it's good. And I'm going for a piss. <laughs> anyway, on the JB Brennan scoreboard. 5 2 32, 2 5 2 32, Lance. She's all level. <laughs> anyway, if Woodside win the flag, everyone's welcome to enjoy a beer at the Stratford Hotel on Monday. <laughs> Courtesy of W. Stratford. She's tough in here. Spear Vardy, oh, good hands to Jennings on the outer wing. Shrugs him off. Playing good play, Jennings. Shrugs him off. Thompson. Thompson all the time in the world. Have a look at this. This is good football. Chisholm fumbles and grabs him in and didn't have it. I'll tell you what, these umpires are right on the ball. No loose men in the forward line. i tell you what, the Devon forward line is struggling. Really struggling. They cannot get it past NR forward. Right on the outer side. Here they go. Now they're a chance. Dunkley marks in front of goal. 30 metres out. Not sure what to do. I reckon he should back himself and have a shot. It's a big kick, this one. Taking his time as well. About 35 metres out, directly in front. 
kicks it into the man on the mark and then hangs on to the man. Oh my God. And the umpire's paid dropping the ball. What's going on? And then he's chipped one straight to the Woodside bloke. This Devon Fordline's got no confidence at the moment. And Stick hang, gives him a hanger straight around the neck. For Devon to win this, they have to start going the ball. Yeah, it's, that's a beautiful mark. Pavey, have a look at him. He's got a bit of space. Ryan. Oh, dear. Touches it. And it goes through for a point. On the W Strikeberg scoreboard, 5-3-33 to 5-2-32. And we're all welcome at the Stratty Pub on Monday. Kicks out. That's a good pass to Kerr. Beautiful smother by Ola Renshaw. Kerr under pressure, runs it in front of himself and puts it out of bounds. Hanley's off. This could be vital. Feeling his calves, his shin. They need him and they need him bad. Dunkley and Bergevin. Bergevin in front. Work each other under the ball. Bergevin gets the handball. Littler. That's a throw, and the umpire can't see it from there. Summers overruns the ball. Out of bounds it goes. Woodside working it down their way. Trailing by a point. Not long to go in this term. Umpire throws it in. Woodside get the tap. Beautifully roved. Up before acceptances. Garner kicks. Anderson. He's got the ball on a string. Didn't have it. Devon kicks off the ground to Jennings, to Pavey. Plenty of time. Kicks long. Oh, Ryan. Beautiful play. Passes, but it's a shocking kick. Ball bounces back in. Kicks off the ground in front of goal. The umpire pays that. He's been paying Tiggy touch with all day. Oh, you should be. What about over the mark? Good play by Woodside, punching from behind. They're disciplined. Yeah, good decision. Umpire bounces down about 40, 40 out from the goals. Devin gets a tap. In hard at the nut. Chisholm gets it. Handballs. Loose handball, though. Straight to Peter Lynch. Who flicks it to Pavey. Kicks long. Who's there? Woodside punch from behind. Straight in Devon's back. Straight to Dunkley. Well, the way he's been kicking, you'd want to have 50 on a point. But you never know. The way he's been kicking, you wouldn't want to back him. Comes in about 20 out. I tell you what, he didn't make the distance. He is injured, Lance. He's up. Stick, he can't even make the distance from there. His knee. He's worried about his knee. Well, it's a great stick. mark in the last line of defence by Bergovic. Welcome back to the YFC for Thanks, the second Harry, time today. Short break, had to catch on a few stats. Out of bounds in the forward pocket. Deep into Devon Walsh for Lance, calling in. Can I tell you one thing, Lance? No one looks like breaking away. It's a tight tussle, isn't it, Bear? It looks like going all Berg the way up. down to the wire. Berg it up against Stick. Play on Philby. Handball's over Stick again. Close contest, be a ball up in the umpire. Tell you what, Jack Kingchurch, Woodside runner, is doing a lot of running. Fit young man. <laughs> you got the fit right. And plenty of cheap Mitsubishis there at uh, <laughs> J.F. King Church Motors. <laughs> Quick snap by Philby, through for a point. This Philby, where's he come from, Lance? He's a Mel uh, comes from Melbourne. 
Walsh come up with the Walsh full side. You know, once of course, once they combine this year, he's you now a player for Devon Walsh full side. No, it's good to see. Terrific hands, great mark. He's been a great mark and good player for Walsh. Anyway, the side. score is 5 4 34. Devon Walshpool to 5-2-32 Woodside one run. Big week by Paley over the back. It was a good attempt. He's played it high. Not flying, uh, three kicks are eating themselves out a bit. I'll tell you what, Devon have got the best of the decisions lately. Chisholm mopping up, dodging himself. Handball to St. Or. Kicks long. Uh, it's a pretty gutsy effort, that. Lynch. Who, who was that to? He's got it back. It was a bit of luck. But Nicholas with a bit of pace, bit of dash from the wing. Kicks long. Up to full forward. Anderson. Ball bounces back in. And another follow up to the Welsh ball side. Good player, McDonald. Tell you what, he's mopping up alright, isn't he? Good player. Anderson's got two goals, but he's playing alright. So I'm gonna be proud today, old Donnie Mac. Spear Vardy, who's had a big quarter, must be at least his tenth possession. Over the top, Cordial, Cordial Episton dives on the ball and forces a bell up. A lot of experience showing there, Cordial could have punched it out, but the Devon players running loose over there, so he opted to close it in and looking for the bounce up. Must be close to the half time siren there. Can only be 30 seconds left, surely. Good hands. Garner gets the ball out of the centre, kicks long. Great recovery. This could be a big mark. Bounces off his chest, but who's it to? Straight up. Oh, have a look at this. Put down your glasses. Oh, glasses. Put down your glasses. I'll put down my can. He should have kicked that. <laughs> oh, my glasses just smashed all over my face. If you, if you don't mind. Well, maybe a bit lats here. Well, I thought he would have finished right off. He could have cut a lunch and had that. Should have kicked that from there. It would have been a vile goal. It would have been a little buffer for him at half time. It's things like that at the end of the day that are going to count. Devon got a bit of system here at fullback, finding the loose man in the back pocket. Keep long up to the wing. It's all Woodside. And a good mark by Summers. Needs to handball it off. They're a bit stagnant, Woodside. There's no runners going past There are there. no runners. They're just standing behind him. If you were the coach of the Woodside team, would you be giving the rabbit half time about running off? Well, that seems to be the difference in the well, They've game. got enough of the ball, but no one's running past. At least Devon have got the numbers. Cordial had the ball, threw it, umpire on the wrong side. Got it back, got rid of it. Kerr playing it out in front of him. He's played pretty well, this kid. Put it out again. Bergevit. Bergevit and Vardy up in the ruck. Vardy in front. Got the tap to Pavey, who gets the kick. Straight to no one. Eppleston got it in front of him. But loses it. Ryan runs it out of bounds. Can only be seconds to go before half time in the big game. Not it was only seconds, 30 seconds ago. Yeah, there's a lot of seconds left. This is a long quarter, Lance. The time goes on. Punch it. Oliver Renshaw looking for on his left. Play and on. dropped it. And picks it up again. Still got it. That's a good decision. That's a top decision. He had three chances, I reckon. Could have took a bounce he had that long. Garner's going to kick the ball along. Pressure by Pavey. High on. Good mark. Oh, that's magnificent. Good mark. Jason Root. Big Root. He's come on with his football. I don't think he, think he can come on, but he has. He's sort of lifting. He's got himself fit this year. There's a sign. Half time. Devin Welshpool. 5 4 34. Versus Woodside one run, 5-3-33. And what a game it is. I'll tell you what, everyone's pretty pumped up. They're all holding their heads of players. They're all worried. You can see the looks on everyone's faces. No one's happy except us, Lance. Jack, just get two injured players here. Eh? They're not likely to take any more place in the game. Uh, <laughs> uh, Holly, okay, we'd be right to come back on if they need you. You'll be right. Back on, back on. Okay, just talking to the uh, Woodside one on uh, bench there, and there's been a couple of changes. Well, there hasn't been changes, but Dan Daniel Hanley is uh, extremely doubtful to take any further part in the game, which is a big blow because he was uh, playing well against Stick and Young Hawley, who was a, a good starter for the one on Woodside team, 
is uh, a chance to go back on if needed. What do you think about that? The thing I'm worried about is whether we can get the crowd off the ground. Have a look <laughs> at the size of it. Oh, it is a big crowd. Oh, what a crowd. And I've heard there's been a few movements in the crowd as well, but anyway, we won't go into that. We have heard a bit that there's been a few movements in the crowd at yeah. half-time, but yeah. like, that's grand finals. Everyone's yeah. expected to be a little bit nervous and that. Anyway, we'll get uh, back onto the game. What amazes me, yeah. a bike that had about 15 possessions in the first half can line up on the wing and the flank and Peter Lynch, 20 metres clear of anyone. So yeah. that's today's football, I suppose. It's, it's, uh, well, if Dwayne Nichols is on Peter Lynch, may I say, Woodside is very confused. Well, he's had a lot of possessions, and we'll see how it pans out. But I can't believe that, that he's 30 metres clear up having all the possessions he's had. But anyway, Keep. anyway the Lance, goes down. Way you go. Stewie Vardy hits off. That man played again. Plays on. He's caught. Well, I tell you what, that is a tough decision. Wasn't that a hot potato? That was a hot bud. Free kick to Jones. Woodside obviously made a move the ball. Jones up the ground and put him on the ball. The left footed Jones kicks down the forward line. McKenzie in front. Left go from behind. Handball's out. Anderson goes hard the ball. Underwood caught one high. It wasn't paid. Handball back out. Back out to Jack Perry. Kerr comes through. He's on his favourite left foot. He has a snapshot. Anderson straight on the chest. Right on the 10 metre square. Barry should finish off here for a goal. Well, all, I can, all I can say to that is that young Curry, Good great player. football brain up for a young kid. Brings it to the top of the square where his full forward's waiting and there's no doubt he'll kick a goal for me. Well, there's a lot of kids in that situation have a wild snapshot, wouldn't they? So that yeah. was good play by bringing it to the front of the square. Good football. And Anderson tops it off with that. No problem. I'll tell you what, Woodside look like they've come down pretty pumped up. They're pretty pumped up. I must admit, though, I thought that decision on Pavey was pretty red hot. What do you think of that, Drew? He did drop the ball, but normally umpires don't pay it like that. Well, he tried to get a handball away, though. But he missed. Play on. Back to the centre. <laughs> OK, the umpire bounces the ball. Umpire's Centre. about to bounce the ball. Here he goes. Here he is. How <laughs> many is back? Bergevet again. To Jansen. Thanks, Dick. He was over the ball. He's played it against Pavey again. Pavey was best on the ground the first half. He's given two vital free kicks away straight away. He's got to be a bit careful. Dixon out in front. Jones. Jones out in front. Takes a mark. Look a lot. Look a lot of life. Dixon, Jones. Dixon on the left foot, of course. Kicks long. Have a look at the numbers though for Devon. They all go up. And about seven hands on the ball, and the umpire bounces it. Umpire says, give it to Murray. But it really fell through, I'm too heavy for that. Summers, it's a beautiful tap. Straight to Woodside. Lynch dives on it, throws it out to Nicholas, who's got the ball and can't get rid of it. And the umpire balls it up. Devin would want to be careful here. Devin want to be careful. They don't want to give one away in front of goal. Out, Cheers, buddy. Oh, a bit slow. Oh, Jack Vardy, he's, he's had a good game. Cheers him again. Cheers him, strong. But dropped it, he dropped that. Oh. And the umpire pays it. It's a good decision. Tried to do a bit much there, didn't he? Oh, Pavey in front again. Pavey's got a bit of class, hasn't he? Yeah, he's a good player. Different class to most of these blokes. Have a look at that for a pass. Stick Dunkley. He's limping, though. Well, they no one stick over the years of the heavy. He's always had that crook knee. I think it's just the gait that he has, he, the way he runs, I think. It's... I'd like to see him kick it, get a bit of confidence. No, he's missed it, I think. He has missed it, kicked it Go off on. to the right. Yeah. No, I, I think it's that knee problem he's had over the years, and it's the way he runs. I, I think he's fit. He's yeah, but he's sore. He's got something wrong with his knee, it's obvious. Well, he's coming into the game a bit. He's presenting himself, making himself a target. No, that's what you got to do. That's all you can do. Third quarter. The crowd spills over the fence. It's a huge crowd at the young man. Ebelson kicks straight out from fullback. Have a look at Bergevit. It's like picking a scone off his mother's plate. Too easy. 
is playing against. And Burbitt's thrown it away. That was a bit harsh. Down, oh. Saino again. In hard and high. That's a costly mistake. Saino has been hard at the ball, and I reckon it was his last year and he was going to make him pay whenever any, any free kicks come up, but he might be starting to cost him a bit. Going too hard at the ball, that was a costly free kick. In front of goal, you can't afford that. Took his eye off the ball, went for the man. It's more courage, it shows more courage to go hard at the football than it does to go hard at the man. And as soon as these blokes learn that, it'll be a lot better for them. That looks like a beautiful kick, well, Lance. Well, he's made him pay. Absolutely made him pay. That's a great goal, boy. Randall, good kick, Randall. Another uh, progeny of the Welsh Football Club. John here, the combination this year, and he's a good straight kick. Have a look at John Coat. He's a bit worried. Anyway, he's got the smile on the face now. <laughs> Around the Woodside area, they've got a lot of support here. That's why it was so quiet when Devon kicked that goal. Vardy has a fresh air shot. Oh. Kerr again. Good Kerr play. again. Can he play? He's only a kid. Beautiful defence by Devon. Dola Renshaw. He's got all the time in the world. Quick hands. Have a look at this. Kicking long. Oh, he had his name sewed all over that, Lance. Rendell, you can't miss this, not from there. Well, he kicks this goal from the last final for him. Second semi. Showing his class, really. A year showing his class. Just a little bit stronger than his opponent there. This is the one that could put him eight points in front. It's a goal. And he's made no mistake. He doesn't miss. Doesn't miss. Doesn't miss. He'll all the kick. Used to be a hard back flanker at Walsh Ball, come through hard, but uh, Andrew Pogge's tried him on the full four this year with great success. He kicked a lot of goals. And playing very well. Scores are Devon Walsh Ball 7 5 47 to the three Ws 6 3 39. And that's hasn't an, it gone quite around here, Lance? That's an advantage of eight points to the uh, Devon Walsh Ball combination. Still, they've got the breeze. Woodside coming home with it in the last term. They, a, they'd need to be two or three up at three quarter time. That is a scoring end. Rucks again, Vardy again. Been good in the rucks, but not around the ground. Kick off the ground by Dixon. Spear Vardy runs hard of the ball out on the flank. Jock Tunnel again, picks up. Handball's over to Flanagan. Spear Vardy under the pack again. Look at him go through. He's tough, he's funny Vardy. Off the ground by Oliver Enchil. Lucky break there, but he was still going forward. I'll tell you what, there's ominous signs here for Woodside Warren. Devon have got runners. They're running past. They're taking marks, well, running past. Woodside seem to be a little bit stagnant. They seem to be getting momentum going here. Ball up on the half forward plank for Devon Walsh for side. Vardy again. Gets a tap out again. Over to Ben Ryan. Ben Ryan. Handballs to himself. He's a live wire. He's a live wire. Handballs himself. Kick out by Walpole. Med hard by Rendell. Play on. Chisholm from behind gives away the free kick. Spear Vardy once again. That was there. Grabbed him around the neck. It was there. Have a look at that. Have, free kicks this quarter, Chisholm. have a look at him. A bit Only a youngster learning the game. That's in the back. I'd say he'll play that. I'd... No, play on. Oh, but look at the Raven by Jennings. Goal. Oh, and he's. Point. Missed it. That's a disappointing miss from there. Well, you look to have it all sewn up, they're running in a run I'll tell you what, neither side can create the break, can they? Well, the most any game. side's been in front has been nine or ten points. This is the biggest, by far the biggest break of the game so far. Eppleson taking his time, kicking long from fullback. It's a beautiful kick, straight to Bergevit. Man in front, punch from beyond. Well, Paul can't, through, can't gain full possession. Chips out, only short. Nicholas. Uses his weight, and he's got plenty at this stage. Handballs he he out to Dixon on the wing. He might have plenty of weight, but he made him look fairly silly then, and he's playing very well. So about, man under it again. Tell you what, he's magnificent in the half-back flank. Oh, didn't be... Here's a oh, loose man. Oh, here's a loose man. Jones by himself. 
Not on his right, he's a left foot, he's got to go back and take his time. Should have played on and used his right foot. Now kicks on his left. Looks for the looting Chisholm. Chisholm takes a mark, just short of centre half forward. Corey Jansen, all by himself, didn't even didn't even present, present Noel himself. No, Thompson, the, the loose man. Thompson at the 50 metre mark. Have a look at the head on Pavey. It looks like he's wearing a friggin' helmet. <laughs> I can assure you it's only shaved. Summons goes up. up. Oh, oh that's got to be in again. danger. They're giving oh, nothing now. High. See the desperation of the Devon Welsh Bull defence. Umpire calls it for a ball up. Good work, Tom. Pop it off. On the, on the J and B Brennan scoreboard, 7 6 to 6 3. Call him back, call him back. Umpire bounces. Desperation oh, in front of him. Warren McKenzie. What a snapshot. What a snapshot by McKenzie. He's picked that up. It was, it was that far. It was that far into the pocket, it was nearly on the gravel and he snapped it straight through. What a shot. Well, I think it's good for the QB. He was left out of the original side and he's come back after being... Uh, How can he ever be left out, though? He's class. Well, he's had class written all over him ever since he left the, he's got the, the team he came from. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's got the pace and that's what they know. If Warren and Woodside start running off their players with the mark... And have a look at the smile on John Code's face now. <laughs> <laughs> Lawson. Troy McKenzie again. again. They got him a bit high. Umpires Umpire. on the wrong side. Couldn't see it. We're in <laughs> Back to you. You take over. Umpire bounces the ball. Sent half forward for Woodside. Berg of it. Didn't even go for it. Shock and bounce. Jennings gets the kick. Oh, soft. That the, was soft. You can't. You cannot even touch anyone in this game. It's unbelievable. Yeah, Spear Vardy, tower of strength, no matter where he plays, and a beautiful pass, hits Randall. straight on the tip. Young Rendell, that's the way he kicks the football. He's solid boy, I'll tell you, look at him. I'll tell you what, I hope he's wearing those uh, bike shorts underneath, otherwise he's short to hanging a fair way down his bottom. But he can kick the football. This will be straight through. I was back in the kicker. Doesn't even miss. He can kick the ball. Doesn't miss many, Ben. I've got one thing to say. The boy can kick. He can kick. And he's hurting Woodside, and he's hurting them bad. Every time Woodside get close, Devon bounce back. They've got the answers. At this stage, they've got the answers. There's a fundamental error there. Jason Chisholm ran up, and he grabbed, grabbed the ball, and he threw it back to the man with a free kick, and he left his own man run back and spear Vardy, and he left him loose. So Jason Chisholm coming out to pick him up. A bad blue. Pavey, quick hands out of the centre. Look at Garner go through. Tough, hard at the ball. And gets it in the back. He's hard at the nut and deserves another free kick against Pavey. He's played well, but he's given a few away. And in the end, wash up their costly lands. Kicks long. Anderson leading out for the ball. But nowhere near. And the ball goes out of bounds on the half forward flank. Umpire throws it in. Stewie Vardy from behind again. Another tap out. Jack Vardy, every, every lob, hands off. Hands off to Flanagan. Oh, have a... oh, goodness gracious, he's miles clear. Over to Jason Reed on the wing, clear. Dribbles a pass off. Didn't have any pressure on. Should have done a better job than Stick. that. Stick Dunley caught underneath the pack. Oh, kick off the ground by Root, and the umpire's called in danger. Stick Dunkley was lucky to get away with that. He was hanging over the ball, but didn't yeah. hit it out. He had his chance. Could have been called holding the man. I'll tell you what, these, both, both these defences have been working over time. Well, it's been a game of defence, it hasn't really. Move the four, or you look at the scores. Eight goals for seven, it hasn't been a game of the four lines for sure. Finally again, Jones out on his left. Final football. Play on. Thompson. Go, oh, Diggy! Up again! Two guns! to come through hard. Handball at the, at the pavey. Oh. That was a terrible kick, but got away with it. Oh, Jocks Underwood with time. Peter Lynch kicks long, straight to full forward. Up they go. Spoil from behind. Woodside yeah, needs some clear. desperation here. Philby. Everson, every lie will kicks clear. 
Che oh, he's dropped an easy chest mark. Took his eye off at least. He never dropped it. Put him under pressure, Lawson runs at the ball. Picks up, clears, clears out to the wing. It's a beautiful kick. Looking for, looking for Budgie. Set him up, wing. should have it. Dives on it. Puts it in favour of his teammate who gets the quick hands off. That's off good. the curve. Takes a bounce. Never look at the class of him. Kicks it into the man. It's a good play. He's too good to be doing that though. It's a good play. Like when you when you're a kid like that, you've got as much class as that. Should have the vision to be able to get round a bloke. Should have kicked it a split second home. Boundary throw in on the outer side. Up they go. Devin get the punch out. To their own advantage. Oh, look at that from Vardy. It's a pavy. Quick hands. Have a look at that. That's class. Long kick to full forward end. That's a magnificent mark. That's the best football of the day. Rendell. Rendell, well, like, how much would you like to have on this? Well, he hasn't missed the last three, so I can't see him missing this one. It's probably not a goal that Warner and Woodside team need against him. Scores 8 6 to 7 3 at this stage. This has just put him in that little bit of a comfort zone. It's a long kick. He's only half the next buck, and that's his. Unbelievable. He does not miss. What a kick. What a player. He's come from nowhere. He's a great kick. But he's presenting himself as a target. He's taken the strong marks. He's doing everything you can ask from a full forward. Wow, you know, like if he presents himself forward. Like we said at half time, Lance. Some forward needs to stand up and be counted and they can win the game. They can win the grand final for their team. Looks like a team. At this stage, it does. I wouldn't write off Anderson, though. He could do something special. Devon win it out of the centre again. Straight to Walpole. He kicks long, straight to their centre half forward line. But who's there? The ever reliable Jocks Underwood who plays on. Kicks straight back to Devon to stick Dunkley. That's a beautiful mark, second in line. That was a huge mark. He had no chance there. He's give it off, give it off. Come from nowhere, mark it. Should be giving it off. Kicks to a pass, kicks it up in the air. Punch behind from Woodside. They've got the numbers. They've got the numbers. And kick long to their centre forward line. He takes the mark and plays on. Backs himself, but I don't think he's good enough. This bike is. He is. Have a look at this. Lovely. That's class. Past the St. All. Who's there? Went up before acceptances. Straight. That's Devon's free kick, and the umpire did the right thing. Anderson flying when he's not even there. Is it Anderson or Summers? They look a lot, a lot alike. Both big lumps of men. Hard to tell from this angle. Yeah, look a lot of light. One's got a ponytail, one's got short back and sides. <laughs> <laughs> Something to do with the amount of cans we've been drinking, but I can't tell. Anyway, Jake Vardy kicks it. Good mark, Kerr in front, bow up, not paid. Jennings. Oh, Jennings on the wing. Kerr again, butters up, handball's out. Kerr has had a lot of possessions. Here's a chance for Anderson. Yes. Uses his body well, outmanoeuvres Pavey and takes a great mark. What I've noticed is quite a bear is Garner's come into the game all for one and Woodside, which means a big plus for him. Vital player for him, Garner. Can't afford to miss this. 15 points behind. So I don't know whether he'll kick it. It's slightly against the breeze, but he's only, I'd say, 40 out by the time the man comes up on the mark. He's coming home with the breeze in the last term. And let me tell you, you've got a fair bit of the crowd behind him, the old Blues. And he can kick a football. Point. He's hooked it. And the Woodside people are confused because they're in celebration mode and he's only kicked a point. Vardy kicks out. No oh, one's on him. Blues the man, Devin have got the runners. They've had them all day. Jo Jock's Underwood. He's a fine player. Walpole, good again. Out off the half-back line. Look at the Punch from beyond. Someone's going to take a mark. Jones. Ooh, point. Perfect opportunist, Jones. I mentioned him earlier in the game there. And he 
done the job against uh, Foster in the first semi in Fish Creek last week in Fleming Farm. He's just yet to come to Woodside his... have had as much of the football as Devon Walsh will, but the problem is they're, they're not, not prepared to run. Just not finished. Well, they're not running like they should run. They, like, they're not running off. They're, like, they're getting... Henry's taking marks and they, like, the, the guys just aren't running off him, you know? Like, he's a big man. He's not quick. He wants to handball the ball. He's got to wait and go back and kick it. It's wrong. Summer's been worked under the ball. Hasn't had his mate. Roger's a fine play, but he hasn't had a big game today. That's class. He reads the ball. This kid Curry, let's come from the kid Curry, and he's good. Uh, uh, Damien Kerr. Damien Kerr, he's good. Damien Kerr has got class written all over him. And if he doesn't make a higher standard of football, I'd be very surprised. Well, we're not here. And we are, so maybe he will. <laughs> The shots are worried now, so is that difficult pocket again? The ball, it's either the football or the way they're kicking it, but the ball's spinning over the top. It's not spinning the right way. Anyway, we'll go back to the W Streitberg scoreboard, 9-6 to 7-5. <laughs> 13 points of difference, deep into the third term. Nicholas, he's got class written all over him. He could jag this on the left. Kicks it up into the goal square. Oh, up he goes. Quick hands from Ola Renshaw. Jennings, quick hands from Jennings. And out it goes. Listen, the crowd going sick. They reckon it was out of bounds on the full. Pretty least still were off in the boot. The umpire's called to throw in. In she comes. Up they go. Back to Pavey. Gets the quick hands. You don't want to be holding it too long because these umpires are red hot on him for holding the ball, aren't they? They are red hot. He's doing a fine job from his, for his team, though. Garner shrugs off a tackle. Quick hands. Punch from... Oh, look at Underwood. Underwood is unbelievable. He's had a magnificent game. Oh, Spear Vardy comes in from nowhere, oh. tried to take out the world and missed. Budgie should have grabbed that ball. Budgie Jansen, that was a bad blow. Have a look at the hands. This is good. To Jennings. Kick short. Dunkley. Dunkley caught behind. Oh, man. My answer's out far. Kerr. Kerr. Class. Berg of it. Down the loose good, man, good play. Give her the hands off. Will not handball, Woodside. Not looking for the runners. Jeez, Nicholas was loose. Yeah. They put themselves under pressure. Well, I suppose that's a pressure from the uh, pressure from the grand final. They're not confident that when all day play. they've tried to kick the ball instead of handball. They've played a slow brand of football when they should be playing. Well, the, the big slip. theory before the game was that Woodside were going to be the running side that beat Devon last week. At kick. the moment, it's the opposite way around. Like they're footing off the pack, so always at the fall of the ball. Woodside one on just haven't been here at the fall of the ball. Well, now it's only 13 points of difference, but Devon are playing a different brand of football. They're playing well, quick the play on football. They've been superior this quarter. And I'll tell you what, the wind's died down as well, Lance. Yeah. Psychologically, that quarter could be in favour, but... 13 points is nothing this day and age. Anyone can win the game, the but... goal here could be crucial. Littler gets the handball off. Oh, gee, oh that is dear, cool. that's a shocking kick. Pavey's fallen over. No problem. Lynch to Pavey. To Jennings. Have a look at this. Takes a mark in front of goal. That could be crucial. He'll be the opportunist. Just drops back. Similar to the mark in the second quarter in the goal square. Just drops back. Hasn't been outstanding, but he's been there when the team's warranted just him. Just standing you know? loose, that's right. Just a loose man. Let Listen me tell you... Put in the glasses. Go. Let me tell you one thing, Lance. As the score goes to 19 points of difference, Troy Underwood has been unbelievable this oh. quarter in the back line. Wow. He's rebounded the ball. His man hasn't had a touch. He's been absolutely fantastic. There was a bad blow there by Budgie Jansen. He tapped the ball on instead of grabbing it. He had a possession. He could have got it and handballed off. But he opted to tap it on. And then Devin come through and cleared the ball, resulting in a goal eventually. 
Not good. Scoreboard, Devon Welshpool, 10-6, 66 to Woodside, one run, 7-5, 47. 19 points, and that extra point is a huge difference. That means a full goal buffer. That was Lance that said that. <laughs> Up they go. Lynch cops it high and gets nothing. Should have been down the field for that, but it was all right. But it was high. Underwood again, under the ball. Jansen. Oh. Didn't have it, too high. Chisholm's been giving free kicks again all day. All day. Listen to the Woodside runner go off. Kingchurch, not happy with that decision. The ball's pretty hot. And Devon Welshpool are desperate. They've picked, they've picked it up a bit. You don't want to do nothing silly here. It'll cost them. Umpire moves in, bounces the ball. Sent half forward for Devon. Up they go. Work each under under the ball. Hard in the packs. And another bounce down. The half forward line for Devon Walshpool side. Umpire bounces down. Throws it up against Reed once again. Very wins it out. Thompson onto the left. Quickly. Jones comes from behind. Corey Jansen. Stand up and be count. Handball's off. Jock's on it again under the pack. Umpire will ball it up. Have you ever seen anyone as desperate as Jock's Underwood? How well is he playing? He's a good player. Jason! Dick, come back! He's a good player. Justin Chisholm seems a bit rattled at this stage. Bear don't know who he's picking up. He's following the ball around a bit much. And giving away free kicks. And free kicks, which aren't... Long kick to Jennings. Straight into the forward line. Have a look at this. Rendell, he's got a bit of time. Don't let him kick it, because you know what he'll do. Gets the hands off. Ola Renshaw. Kicks it to the centre of the square. Punch by Woodside. Work the ball out to the outer boundary. Walpole. Good yeah, it's hand good hands by Walpole. Pole. Hands off to Thompson. Now over the curve. We know what he can do with the ball. Kicks it long down the wing. Oh, straight to Roy. Roy's been a good play for him. Their centre half back line has been magnificent, Lance. <laughs> Pick one out. And let me tell you something, when things are going for you, the umpires go for you too, don't they? They can pick them out from nowhere. Ola Renshaw, pass the ball to Dunkley, who makes good position. Ooh. Comes off his hands and well roved by Philby, but misses. Could have made a big dent in the scoreboard at that stage. 10 7, 67. Devin Welshville to 7 5. 47. 47. 20 points of difference. But don't forget Devon Washburn coming home with the, the aid of a slight breeze. One on Woodside. Yes, one on Woodside. <laughs> a little bit of confusion set in there. Anyway, stiff shit and on with the show. Ellison kicks out and pull back. Good long kick. That's what I need a long kick. Dunkley up from behind. Thompson in front. Hamill's over Dixon. Lawton's gone for the boundary and has kicked it on the full. Oh, geez, a man from experience he went, shouldn't do that. He went for the boundary. And found it. And found it. But how silly was that? We've gone for Rendell's lead. Hasn't made it. Dropped short of him. They've put it out of bounds. Deep in the forward line of Devon. Woodside, can, Woodside one run. Cannot afford another goal, Lance. No. Up she goes. Dunkley and Bergevit. Bergevit gets a tap. Dunkley pounces on it. Gets the hands off. Oh, the wrench on his Should have had a shot. To Pavey, who snaps, is smothered. Look at the desperation. Point. Have a look at that. Jennings sl slams it on his boot straight through for a point. Signs are bad for Woodside. Pavey's leading from the front. He's showing the way in this corner. He's played a fantastic game. Given away a couple of free kicks, but all in all, he's given absolutely everything. Is that short kick out again? Look at the, the hand off. I need to break it up, Woodside, this running game. Down Kerr. Oh, he's too good from out there. See the way he trapped that. He's got class written all over him to Dixon, to centre forward, Anderson, sprinting flat out. And Marks, 60 out from goal. Should play on. Does. Kicks the pass. And what a mark. And Cops run for his trouble. Corey Jansen. 
Cost five for his trouble, Jansen. On a 45 degree angle. Not on his favourite foot, he's on the he's on the wrong side for a left footer. Oh, the siren goes. Have you ever seen a more vital kick than this? Well, I think for them to have a chance, he's got to kick this. Look at the Devon players rush into the goals. That's all to no avail because you kick it over there, friggin' heads. Goal. Yes, he's, very much he's missed it. He's hit the he's post. Hit the post. Oh. oh, Jesus, they couldn't afford to miss that. Well, crucial miss there. Crucial miss. Hit the post, exactly what I didn't know. Watch out. Okay, three quarter time's over. 10 8 to 7 6. And I have never seen as many people on the ground at three quarter time at the Yarram football ground in any game ever. Have a look at Bergevert. He's strutting around the centre, kicking with a breeze in the last term. Yes. And the Blues are a big chance. Okay, I'll give him a call after. Thank you, boy. Here comes the old text. This is what we come here to see. This is what football's all about. We on? We on? Yes, Lance, we're on. Henry Bergevert limbers up for the big last quarter. Could be his last year. Who knows? He keeps going on. He, he won't be his help. last year. He's too good to stop now. Oh, I tell you what. Up she goes. Umpire walks. Puts the ball Get off. Some comments from the boundary man. Up she goes, ball's bounced. Oh, beautifully won by Vardy. Devon, get it. Spear Vardy, kicks long to stick Dunkley, who's spoiled by the man in front. Walpole gets it on the outer wing. Beautiful pass to Nicholas. Good spoil from him. Oh, good work, Spear. Have a look at the desperation on these Devon blokes. While Paul's featuring well out there, he's coming right into it. He's played well. His last couple of quarters have been magnificent. Kicks long. Up to Woodside, centre half forward. But who have they got? They've got no one. They've got no one in the forward line. Thompson. Thompson. Kicks an up and under. A big up and under as well. Anderson comes out, tries to get the mark. Oh, look at this for pressure in the back line. Umpires are paying nothing, just letting the ball go, and it's good umpire at this stage of the game, Lance. How do we go at three quarter time? What the, what the coaches say, Tex? Three quarter time, both coaches are both in the same sort of mode. They've worked hard this year, they've got to the last quarter of the grand final. They're both asking for that extra effort from their players. They want 99.9% .9 in this last quarter. They know it's going to be one or two goals. Whoever gets the first couple of goals. Woodside are 19 good. points down. What did their coach say? They're they 19 need, points down. They need the first goal on the board. He says, guys, we get the first one. They need to That's run past. The they need to have a little bit of a go. They're not he running wants, past. Like you said, he wants his forward line to lift. He said, forward line, this last quarter, you must lift for us to win this game. You must take those big masks, kick those big goals. Like we've all seen Woodside play before. We know they've got a magnificent side, but like... They're a, they're a mere shadow of their former selves, Lance. Well, I think you've got to give a bit of credit to the Devon Wildsport side. And this bike here with the ball at the moment. Pavey, quick hands. Have a look at that. Slams it to Bergevin, who overruns it. Through his legs. Didn't want it. He wanted it. Here we go. Warren McKenzie kicks long. Oh, Anderson all by himself and takes a mark in the forward pocket. I'll tell you what, this could turn the whole... If he can kick this, this could change the whole thing. The whole game. He might have kicked 100 and whatever this year, but this is the one that really counts, Lance. He's what, got to kick this. Well, it's not an easy shot from that position on the ground. He's got the wind in his favour, blowing down that end, the church road end. Pretty good goal. He called it at three-quarter time. They must kick the first two goals. Kicks it and hooks it. That's a bad out in the fall. That's a terrible miss. Could be costing the game. Could cost them the game, but there's a long way to go. 10 8 69, 10 8 68 to 7 6 48. 20 points of difference. Four minutes into the last term. Four minutes. Stop. You see, you got the watch going there. Kick out from the back pocket. 
Old Ernshaw losing the fight. Handball's out of the bench line. Thompson should sit for Thompson. Play on. Handball over. But he handballs to no one. Who did he handball it to? Again. Good Is body that? work. No. Oh. Who's that? Philby. Philby. Should have marked that, Rendell. Oh, they got some time here. Have a look at Rendell running in the way. All he's got to do is pick it up and slam it through. Off his oh. knee. That's a point. That must be off his knee. Well, no, it's off his oh. foot. He's given it. Well, dear oh dear, what's on people? They can count himself very unlucky. That was off his knee. Well, goalpost in the best position to have a look. We've got the commentary, but we haven't got the best high, the unfortunately. You take what you get. You take what you get in football, and that must be his fifth. Well, he's, I think he kicked three in that third quarter, one before that. That'll be his fifth there. What an impact the young man's had on the big final. Berg of it, desperate, gets the two to Summers, who's got no left foot, kicks it on his right but short. Oh, oh look at this short. defense. Good. Kicks long. Out of Reed, Reed on the wing. Setting play by Howie out of the back pocket, good play. Reed looks for the short pass. That's a terrible Thompson kick, Thompson with time. Over to Sainal. Sainal clears. Kick out from Flanagan from the Oh, there's no one. Where's Woodside? They're gone. They are gone. Have a look at this. Cordial Eppleston. Oh, he needed to get rid of that quickly. And forces it out of bounds in the back pocket. Seven minutes into the last term. Devon Welsh for 11 8. 7 6. To Woodside, one run, 7 6. Bergevin hits it over the back to no one. Devon Welsh pull. Oh. Do you think he stopped there? He may have hang, hung back a little bit, but no problem. Underwood, he won't stop. He will not stop. He will give it his absolute all. And look at him! He is desperate. He's been magnificent. He has played a magnificent game. He has played an absolutely blinding game. Umpire bounces the ball. Summers, up he goes. Loses the tap out. The Garner goes through. No, no, overruns it. I know no, it Oh, oh how high do you want it? But not that high, the umpire says. She's a scramble. She's just tough in there. It's finals football, and you can see that. Well, I'd say for Wanderer and Woodside to be a chance, they need the next couple of goals in the next couple of minutes. I'd say for Wanderer and Woodside to be a chance, they need about half a dozen Barockas. I'd say they need the next couple very quickly. Over oh, that's be beautiful, hands. See the no, hands from well, Littner. Yes, you kicked the Tory. Oh, and on the full. The free kick to Woods on the forward pocket. Corey. Garner slammed it on his foot, Corey bounced Jansen. back and hit, unfortunately hit the Devon Welshpool player on the foot, went out of bounds. Corey Jansen will be on his left foot, no, which won't be the best shot for him. He might try the big banana punch. I'll tell you what I think he should do, run out, run out wide and kick it on his right. He's kicked the drop punt. To goal. To goal. That's what they need it. And boy, oh boy, did the three W's need that. Did they need that? What do you think? What? That brings a J&B Brennan scoreboard to Devon Welshpool, 11-8. To the three W's, 8-6. What are some of the moves that you would make as a coach for the three W's better to bring them back in the game? Well, what they've got to do is get their best players on the forward line because they've got to win the game. And that's what they haven't done. They've had their best players on the back line. Their back lines, both back lines have dominated today. They need to do something extra special. That's good football in defence. Look at this Pavey. He's been a bit quiet this quarter, but he's given his all. Oh, shrugs him off. Tries to pass it to Pavey. Got hit in the head, but that didn't hurt him. He's got no hair. Oh, I'll tell you what. They've got a sniff, Woodside. Thompson running through. Walpole should take a bounce. He's got all day. Kicks long. Anderson shrugs yeah. it off. Oh, Have a look at this. He handballed it. Lance, he handballed it. What do you think of that? That's the first time we've seen that all year. All day anyway. <laughs> Probably should have had a snap. It's been forced into a ball up. 
Can't you feel the tension now, though? The people, look at the people. The looks on their face, full of anticipation. Summers captured forward. To goal. Oh. Opportunity. Opportunity. Yeah, but what about the play by Summers? Did you see him tapping forward from the boundary? Yeah. Fine tap, Rockman. Yarram taught him everything he uh, knows. Yarram taught him nothing. Isn't it unbelievable <laughs> how football can change so Yarram quickly? Yarram taught him nothing. There, you set me up. 11, 8, 74 to 9, 6, 60. 14 points of difference. Well, 14 points is nothing. I'll tell you what, there's... There's 18 minutes to go here in the last term, and I'll tell you what, you've never seen a crowd pumped up like this. Look at the centre bounce. The desperation is unbelievable in the umpire bounces. Well, would you like to see the next guy to one more try to make a game with there, or you're favouring the Devon boys? What I'd do you think? I'd like to see Devon win, you know. Woodside won the flag last year, and you know they know what it's all about. It's been a long time for Devon, since 87, Devon and yeah. They're a new club, newly formed. Be good for the competition, be good for the blokes. Good for the old favourites down, a few of the old favourites at Walsh called Johnny Mack and a few of the Yeah, boys. it'd be nice to see. But still, you don't grudge anyone a premiership, and if Woodside are good enough to get up from here, They'll fully deserve it. And look at Spear Vardy. God, has he put his heart and soul into this game. Well, he's a Vardy and he won't give anything up. He won't give an inch. He's got the brother swaps on the boundary. He's not giving an inch on the boundary either, they tell me. Anyway, play goes on. Big hit out. Uh, Slop. Mother boy, Garner. Look oh, at no. this. Here we go. Got Tom, rid of it. Thompson. Over to Thompson. Over to McKenzie. Oh, Anderson. Got a bit of space. Had another handball to a loose man, the goal square. The goal. And another one. Not over this game, very well, long shot. Have a look at it. Have a look oh, at the, the paper. Well, sitting up here on the uh, woodside box. Got a step, it's anyone's game. Well, the special comments from Tex Holland, he knows what's going on. He said it's anyone's game. As soon as you give a solo one. Get one the, the kids side. off the ground. <laughs> well, I'll take over here for a minute, Bear, while you just relax a bit. <laughs> So the Yarram boys in front of the bow, they're going wall. Sibby Davis and Slug. Yarram boys, as usual, in front of the bow when the grand final's on, never there when the fucking big time counts. Oh, stop, stop. <laughs> Cut. Special comments? <laughs> oh, you, you can really. Oh, didn't he go in hard then? Have a look at this for desperation. Special comments from Tex, what do you mean? I think the next five minutes could turn the tide. It's obvious, one of the woods has got a run on. Anyway. We'll go back to the W Stripeberg scoreboard here at the Stratford Hotel. 11-8 to 10-6. If Woodside win it, everyone's welcome there Monday for free grog. Well, look at Woodside getting the hands to Thompson. Thompson on the left, little chip pass. Drop what he should have taken and look at Devon mop up Jennings. Kicks it out of bounds. That's class. He's had a great game. Great game, Jennings. Play well. Come on with Pavey, with Andrew Pavey from the... Uh over the Churchill line, he's been a good player for them all year. I have a special mention, special mention, Adam Vardy, 25 years old today, wearing number 25 from Devon. What a birthday for him if you can win this damn title. To Vardy, turns around, back to the ball, this would be a blinder, hard at the ball, gets a tap over. Go hard! Oh, oh Pavey, no he didn't have it, that's a correct decision. That's a seventh free kick today is given away and as they switch the play. That's risky. But, nah, uh, Chisholm. Well, they've got to take risks. Yeah, they've they got to take risks. I wouldn't have gone as wide as that, but they have. Nicholas, have a look at him. They won't catch him. He might be fat, he might be slow, but he's got pace and they can't catch him. To Littler, who centres the ball. Have a look at this. Oh, that's, that's courageous. Hits the goal post in the last line of defence. Oh, have a look at this. They've got some space. Chips over to Spear Vardy. Spear Vardy finds Ollie Hinshaw on the wing. Ollie goes in on his natural left foot. Back to Bergman in front. Oh, you can't beat the big man. He should handball off. There was a short one. Finds Walsh in the south. Handball off. He's done the hamstring again. He's not fit. He hasn't done the hamstring. He's done the freaking heart. It's a grand final. <laughs> it's a bloody last quarter and he's limping. Oh, jeez. Oh. Kick it short. Time and time again, Jocks Underwood, he's pulled that Woodside attack up. He must be one of the best players in this league I've seen. Kicks it to Pavey. 
And he's giving, he's giving everything. Kicks long to the half forward line. But I'll tell you what, young Benny Ryan, he's got two against him. I don't know if he's good enough to beat him. You cannot beat two on the one. No. Pavey comes in hard. He's hurting. He's hurting. Holding the man. Comes in hard and down he goes. Kerr. Is that Kerr? No, that no it's not Kerr down. He was hit hard anyway. Good handball, Neil. Kick. Oh, he's Thompson. Thompson. Kicks under pressure. Look at Pavey. Good it's the rock of Gibraltar for this side. They don't want to be taking his time. They're only bloody eight points in front. And there's ten minutes to go. He's taking oh, his time. Plenty of time. If they eh? go defensive, they'll lose it. He's got to have a go. He had no one to kick to, though, Rowan. Just no one there. Who's he passed that to? He's passed that to young Ben Ryan. I tell you, there's some weary bodies here. Oh, look at this. Stick. Stick. Went hard at it. This Woodside defence, both defences have been magnificent. Oh, how much more has he got to do, this man? Stick by himself. Stick Dunkley. Oh, someone's cut him in front. Kurt. Oh, Lorenzo. Oh. Hasn't got it. Oh, look at the desperation on top of it. I tell you what, these umpires have let it go. They've made it a good game. Well, it's what they've got to do, Bear, in the last quarter. Swallow they've the made it a fantastic game. Swallow the whistle and let it go on. Look at Eddie, Eddie, Eddie Lithgow warming up on the boundary. All cock. Eddie all cock. What a marvellous big young penis it is. Kick long. Oh, good mark. Sensational. Jason Reed. Jason, one of the marks for the game. Jason oh, Reed has been magnificent good today. Mark under pressure. Taking his time. Kicking short. Oh, that's a beautiful pass. That's a good hand to fill the Otaja. Going this Philby is underrated. Well, he's not underrated. I'll tell you, he's got good hands, and that's what he's there for. He's shown these supporters a thing or two today. You should, if you could only top it off with a goal. This is the one they need. Oh, that's a shocking kick. The old side by sider. Sainal in defence. Oh, have a look at him. He could have kicked that out in the full. No. What are they doing, Nick? He's grabbing the ball, Lance, in the back line, taking a bounce, and he's kicking, trying to kick torpedo passes. I must like, admit, should have looked for a man. This is not his football. Should have looked for a man before he took the bounce. Show him by the bounce. Bergevin taps out. Peter Lynch again. Would have had 20 possessions this game. Good effort. Saying all. Oh, hang on. Oh, he's uh, played the what? 50. That is stupid. Was it a light whistle or not? Was it a light whistle? No, the mark was there. He took the mark. There's no problems with that. And spear come in. Come in for no reason and done that. And Could this bloke, that from here? this bloke has done a magnificent job. Magnificent job. They're on the Noel Thompson on the 50 meter mark. Eight points behind. He's this got. Could take his time. He's, he could do he's got to hit someone on the tip. He's kicking it into the man on the mark. Can you believe that? Guess who? Jocks Underwood. This is starting to get boring. Oh, he's tried to take it. Oh, Bergevin kicks long. Oh, a point. 11-8, the 10-7. Devon Welshpool, seven points in front. There's seven minutes to go, and oh, my God. Go, Ziggy! I'd say it'd be a good ten minutes to go. Look at the loose man, though. That's loose. They That's have loose. played this loose man well, but he's got no one to kick to. He's kicking it to space. Eddie Lithgow overruns it. Damien Kerr, he's had it on a string all day. Gives it to Dixon. Passes it to Chisholm. He's got all the time in the world. Play on, son. He's played on. He's hit Summers on the tit. He's fumbled it, but he's taken the mark. Hadn't had a good day, Roger. Summers got to kick long. Hasn't had a good day. It's his first kick grand long. final. Kicks long. But boy, oh boy, do Woodside need a mark here. Anderson oh. grabs it. Point. Anderson snaps. And what's he snap? He oh. snaps a point. It's a goal and Jimmons in a big game. Kick oh, Lance, what's going to happen if it's a tie? We'll be back next week for a, another Baron Hulk commentary. You don't play extra time? No extra time, Tex. A big oh. replay in the AFL. 
But I'll tell you what, this game's been that good, I'll come back to see the replay. <laughs> I'd bring, well, I'd bring Greg McLeod, but he's not allowed back in the town. It's a game we all wanted. Summers, desperate. Oh, look at this for desperation. Summers. They're magnificent. I tell you what, Woodside have come back from nowhere. They have come back from nowhere. The Blues are running home on a roll. Big boundary throw in, Devon over the top, get the tap down. Who to? Watch Noel Thompson in front, Watch what can he do with it? Overruns it. Devon gets it to Pavey, the ever reliable. Who's he kicked it to? Walpole. Oh, gee. Walpole on the half back flank, he's been Woodside's best player in my opinion. Kicks it long to the half forward line. Who's there? No one off in the running either. Flanagan oh. comes to handballs the spear. Over to Pavey. Power Pavey's been a power strength for the combined. Oh, Handball look at this. Over to Thompson. He thinks he's got all day, but it's a grand final. Gives it the hall. Jumpers give the advantage. Oh, 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 oh he's dropped it. Hey. And Underwood again. Off the oh. car, he's on his natural left foot. He'll kick the ball long. Anderson! Anderson is taking the market full forward. He's given it to the opposite way, the umpire. Oh, no. The umpire has just played the worst decision you've ever seen. seen. That is unbelievable. He's used his body, he's taken the mark, fair and square, and he's played it against him. Oh, what's he doing here? Oh, oh. They call play That was there. No, that there. was there. Henry took the mark. Jeez. How long do you think to go on this game, Ben? There's got to be about four minutes to go. This will be it. Anderson. The crack ball forward, you think? He didn't take, kick the goal. The big fella, the big crack ball forward with Devin Walsh for 11 8. The Woodside one run 10 8. He needs to kick this to tie the scores. And you have never seen so many people so freaking nervous at one time. Look at Jack Kingchurch. Have a look at him. Anderson kicks it, hooks it, hooks it, and Devin punch. Devin punch from behind. Look at Thompson, vital to their chances. He's off. Blood real. Blood streaming out the back of his head. They've got no one to come on. He's coming off for no reason. It's back in. He's got another kick, Anderson. It's a sensation here at the Yarran Ground. They're giving him another kick. You just can't do that. The they umpires, give him another kick. Like, the umpires have done, a fine, they've done a fine job all day, but they're, now they're starting to confuse the issue. If he kicks this, the scores are square. He's done it's, the same again. I think the eyes must have been shut for a minute. Oh, my fool. Well, may I say, fully deserved. Fully, de fully deserved for no other reason than he had his kick, he had his chance. And he didn't make the most of it, so why get another kick? That's bullshit. Devon, Jack Bart in the last line of defence, passes it. Jason Lloyd. Finds a teammate. Oh, look at the nerves. Look at him. Half back flank. Half back flank for Devon. Good bar. Oh, he's, he has taken a blinder. McDonald. Oh, look at Macca. Young Mongo. Young Mongo McDonald's kicked it to the wing. He's all man to be proud. He's played the fruit of Walpole. He's that was there. Well, no, Thompson. He's back on quickly. Summers. Center. Summers. There are a goal behind. There's two minutes to go. And look at this. Oh, what a mark. What a mark. Jock Sunderwood has taken a hanger. What a mark. He's taken a hanger. Take your time, son. Stick Dunkley. Got his hands to it. He, on, he can only even run. Look at Ollie. All the, oh, oh, he's kicking out in the fall. All they need is a point. Damien Kerr on the half back flank. Kicks long into the centre. Littler. Littler's done nothing all day. Play the ball? No. He hadn't played the ball. Littler has been a fantastic player for Woodside over the years, but today hasn't been his best day. It's a goal at Edmonton, a big game. Yeah, Conspicuous by his absence. He has been down a bit on his stands, but he's got the club through to the another ground. He's a line. magnificent coach, and no one can take years. that away from him. And they can still win it from here. Have a look at the desperation. I still think there's time. Look at Spear Vardy. Oh my god, does he love this club? 
It's his birthday today, 25. He wears 25, but it's his 25th Hit. birthday today. And I'd say he'll have 25 jugs tonight if they win tech. Littler gets the hands off. But who to? Who to? Uh, Hawley, young Hawley, he's got it. Oh, Devon had got it in the last line of defence. Look at the desperation. Jack Barty again. They cannot be long to go. Ball pot. Have a look at Stick. He got the hands out. That's good hands. Have a look at this. Devon Washburn, they're clear. Still in, still inside. Dixon gets onto a tour. Summers has got his name written all over it. He's in front. Chisholm tries to get it. That's got to be too high. How high do you want it? That's the worst decision I've ever seen. He played against his only bias here, Brad. He's got to play that he shouldn't have shot. That's utter bullshit. He dragged it in. Kerr's been good. Kerr's been a great play on the side. He's the one go He's the one going the ball. They've, they've pinged him for that. Well, oh, oh, who's that? Jack Vardy. Neil Vardy, well, he is different class. Look out. He's taking his time. He wants to hurry up. The umpire will give him the hurry up. He's passed it off. He's passed it off, and the umpire's paid it. Look at the Woodside boys. Aren't they going sick? Hello. Devon in the last line of defence. Six points of difference. Oh. Three minutes to go. Kick it to the outer wing. Oh, and they put it out of bounds. Hello. 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 Someone tried to ring me. Have they? a look at this. Hello. Come on. Come on, stick. I want a mobile. Someone was ringing me. Okay. Come on. Stuart Barty for a chance to stay off. Got it and got rid of it. Barty, they're outnumbered. The blue jumpers, they got it. Three wood sides. No, only two wood sides. They're all wood sides. They've all got it. Littler, he's coming good when it counts. Kicks long. Hall goes up, drops the mark. He can't play that. Look at the desperation. There can only be a minute left. Three kicks to Devon. Crucial he's, stage of the game. That's played unbelievable. Old. He's played on the ball. He's, he's done Can't the chip pass. Look at this. Woodside's got it back. Here goes going. And on and the, the ball. Oh, crucial. Vital stages of this game. I tell you what, both defences have been magnificent. They want it like... But whoever loses, whoever loses this game, if you were a defender, you can count yourself stiff because you have been magnificent. Welcome back to you, Donnie, for the third time Hello. today. 11-8, oh, 11-8 to 10-8, one goal Summers up he goes, to go. punch behind, yeah, Devin, one goal up. It looks again, it looks have a look at the tension will you, have a look at this, Woodside had an attack all quarter, I just, just can't get that goal, Woodside have had it all quarter, Anderson has had the chances, Berg of it, he's going up, Warren up. McKenzie running onto the ball, slips over, Woodside had everything, I just can't let him get a goal, have a look at him, Nicholas. Yeah, one goal. Oh, here we go. Kerr. 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 Who's he kicked it to? Oh, Beautiful play. Oh, he's That's a kid he's going to get some down. Have a look at this. Kerr again. And again. Oh, he's going to get him a free kick. Oh, and the desperation. Oh, what about the crowd? What about the tension here at Yarram Football Ground today? Just call it, Don't worry about it. Well, I'll give you a call back. All right. What's happening? Take his off. Right there. The coach has got to go down the back. Report it. 15 minutes. Well, we didn't see what happened there, but this man walking off the ground, he has given absolutely everything for Devon Walshpool Football Club today. He's been magnificent. Absolutely magnificent. He's led from the front. He's been an inspirational leader. He deserves all the applause he's getting, which is nothing, because this is a Woodside area. <laughs> Up she goes. And Stick punches out of bounds. 
Well, there wasn't many short nails at seven. I don't know if they can hang on. There. One goal was different. Well, do you think the inspiration from the coach might be enough for the ball? There's a the siren! There's a the siren! Yeah. Look at Nigga. What's he doing? That's a final sign here at the AFL Grand Final. Have a look at, 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 at Nigga Lynch Brent on the ground. Unbelievable. Did he play for them this year? No, he's a chairman selected. Oh, is he's he? To bring in, put into it. Well, he's pretty happy then. Oh, well, have a look at that. Final scoreboard, Devon Walshpool, 11-8. A total of 74 to the three Ws, 10-8-66. And what a game it's been. What a game. Deserves to be no loser here. No loser. But as the case in great sport, great sport like Aussie Rules, you've got to have one loser. And the three Ws, you, three Ws have done it today. They've lost. They've given absolutely everything. Five surgical awards, please. It's been an absolute pleasure to stand there and watch this game today. They've given absolutely everything. Blood, sweat and tears. Can I speak to John Winnerton, please? The disappointment on the Woodside people's faces is unbelievable. Where? Anyway, yeah. let's tune into the winners for a while. Yeah, they held up playing. Have a look at them. Have a look at the crowd. The whole crowd went mad. And he ran off the boundary. They had one more kick down the ground. So, um, it's the first year they've ever merged, Devon and Welshpool. They've merged. Not only have they merged, they've recruited. And they've made themselves the best team in this competition. They fully deserve their victory. And look at the support they've got. Have a look at the support they've got. This is what football's all about. You could not grudge them a thing. It's been magnificent. What a game. What a game. Here, just bring us at home. Yeah. You've got to feel for the Woodside blokes. They gave everything. Absolutely everything. It's been a low scoring game, but Right. The defences of both sides right. stood supreme. Right. And it's okay. been an absolute yeah. credit yeah. to both sides this game. Absolute credit. We still on, mate, or we off? Still on? What more can you say? Well, Bear, what do you think? It's a successful side. Devon Walsh, Bill. It's pretty cruel. Sport's pretty cruel. Well, one goal of a difference, you know, and full credit to Andrew Pavey and his mob out there. and. Dave Vardy and uh, Alan Pearce and the president of the club took it on this year and he's uh, done a great job and the committee, I'll tell you what, I'm a bit, a bit sentimental but I've got to hand over a, a special mention to an old mate of mine, Johnny McDonald down at Wellsville. I touched spoke to him before the game and he said he, glad he's not playing he was up tight and, and the butterflies and i tell you what Johnny, over to you mate, I said I couldn't wish you all the best, I couldn't wish you any more luck, good on you Johnny. Fantastic. There's people like that that make football clubs. Well, he's he's been a guy. I went down to Walshbourne Coach for three years and he stuck by me down there and he Walshbourne were nearly gone. And they joined up with Devon and they've come right through and they've won a flag and, and good luck to him. Have a look at Dean Vardy out there. Yep. He missed out through suspension. He's missed suspension, but I'll tell you what, he'll be amongst them tonight. He's played his part. He's let his presence be known. Okay, maybe he might have done the wrong thing. Maybe he might have been reported. But he gives his guts, his soul. He gives everything to his footy club. That's all you can ask. These blokes are deserve this. They train every Sunday. They do all the hard work. And all I can say is congratulations, you know? Well, you know, congratulate the winner. And to Andrew Pave and his mom, well done. Good effort. In the feet, Woodside have been fantastic. Oh, magnificent. They were gone. They lost what a game. going through the inner. I was hoping they'd miss out and the typical tall poppy syndrome. What more can you say? What more can you say? Did is they come like, through? You know, you feel for them, you feel for people, but like they had it last year, they won it last year. That's a good experience. It makes men of people to be able to be on the losing side of it, you know? Absolutely. They'll come back, they'll bite their tongues and it'll be a big inspiration for them next year. 
Absolutely. But have a look at this mob. They're in the glory. They got it all. They got a few days ahead of them. Good luck to them. A few big days ahead of them. Good luck to them. <laughs> Anyway, Lance, Lance, we've had a good time up here today, mate. Yeah, well, anyway, Bear, thanks As for coming up. Ex Sharon Play. Ex Sharon Play. Not biased. I'm not part of the finals again. Yeah, not part of the finals. I'd like to sign off and wish all the two clubs the best for the night. Probably down with a better night than Woodside, but thanks very much for the chance to commentate and uh, hand it over to you, cameraman. Yeah. And he's gone. Hey, Michael. 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 Hey,